Hey, I'm Sven. Welcome to Edge Home Workout video channel. Today, we're going to do some strength because even when we work out at home without the fancy gym material, we can still work at our strength. Now, the only difference that we do when we work with uh, high weights is that we lower the pace of our exercises and we take a little bit less rest in between each set of exercises. Today, we're gonna do some lower body strength exercises followed by a cardio exercise. Um, what you need for today is some kind of a weight, a heavier weight. I'm gonna use a bucket and you can fill it with water um, as much as you want. The more water, the heavier the weight, of course. You'll need a bench or um, some higher um, step up. Um, you need a lower step up. It can be some books uh, on top of each other um, and maybe a wall to keep your balance. Um, I'm gonna walk you through all the exercises. We have four strength exercises. I'm gonna show them first, demonstrate them. Then you can pause the video, do the exercise with the indicated reps and sets and continue for the following exercise. All right, here we go. For the first one, we need our bucket with some water in um, and we're gonna do a deadlift. Now for this exercise, um, you will have to do 30 repetitions. So it's quite um, a lot because we have, the weight is a bit um, yeah, lower than in the gym. Um, for a deadlift, we stand in between or the weight is in between our feet. I take the bucket like this. You make sure that your back is straight, your hamstrings, the back of your legs is tight and you're gonna lift up and push from your butt into the bucket and back down. You go up and back down. Very important is that you keep your chest horizontal to the floor and that you make the movement with your butt going to the front and to the back. So it's not a squat, it's really a hip hinge and you keep your legs as tight and as straight as possible. So, Again, you do this for 30 repetitions. Your head is in a neutral position. You go up and slowly go down. Up and slowly go down. And repeat this for 30 times. In between, you take 30 seconds of rest and you repeat these exercises for four sets in total. So four sets of 30 repetitions. Good luck. Now, for the second exercise, we do calf raises. You'll need a little bit of a step up. So like I said, it can be books, it can be some plates. I use a little bench. You step up with your two feet. You just keep your toes on the border of the step up. You can take a wall or something else to have your balance. You push up from your toes and you slowly go down, lower, then the bench, back up, slowly go down. So do this exercise as slow as possible, especially the going down part. This will help you strengthen your muscles more. And you repeat this for 20 repetitions. Then you take 30 seconds of rest in between and you repeat in total four sets of these exercises. So you can pause this video, do it at your own pace, and when you're ready, we'll continue with the next exercise. The following one is a one leg box step up. For this, you need somewhat a higher bench. We're gonna repeat this exercise for 15 times each leg. So you step up with one leg, you go up and back down and step off. Go up and back down. So 15 times the same leg and you push really from the leg that's on the bench. Start, try not to bend too much to the front, just put your leg and you push up from your bended leg up and down. 15 times one leg and then you switch 15 times to the other leg. And then again, you repeat this in total for four sets. 
The last exercise from this strength part is a split squat. For a split squat, we don't need any material, just our body. You can stand in a split squat, so one leg behind the other one. It's a bit like a lunge. You go down on your knee and you jump up. Go down on your knee and jump up. Again, do this slow, the lowering part, and jump explosively back up. Repeat this 10 times on one leg, then we switch to the other leg, go down and jump up. Go down and jump up. Ten times each leg, repeat this in total for four sets. All right, this was our strength part, so I hope you've done all the exercises and you felt a little bit burning. If you feel that a certain exercise is too light, you just keep on doing this for more repetitions. So even with body weights or low weights, we can still work our muscle strength. For the second part, we're gonna do a workout, a bit more cardio related, and you can choose. You have to work for time, so as fast as you can, the exercises that I will explain later. And you can choose or you repeat this for three rounds, four rounds or five rounds. Three rounds is more like an intermediate workout. Four to five rounds will make it much harder. So depending on your level of cardio, you can choose how many rounds you can do. I will put this material a bit to the side. For this workout, we will need two smaller weights. So again, these can be water bottles or something you can take in your hands. You have to have a good grip. Um, so a water bottle is ideal. Um, make sure you have it in your hands. We're gonna use our deadlift weight from earlier. So we still need our bucket. Don't throw away the water. We can use a mat for the ground exercises and that's it. So I will explain all the exercises first. Then you can pause the video and do it at your own pace. You also need a timer so you can use your cell phone. Um, and you just need the number of seconds. So just like a chronometer or something will do. We're gonna start in 10 seconds and I will explain all the exercises when we're doing the uh, workouts. Just watch first, then you pause the video and then you can continue at your own pace. So I'll put the chronometer. He's just gonna add up the seconds because in between every exercise you need to do 30 seconds of quick feet. So you just run on the same spot and you try to run as fast as you can, also using your arms. So the faster, the heavier. And keep on doing this for 30 seconds. When you finished, you watch your chronometer, when you finished 30 seconds, you do five burpees. Five burpees, so it's on the floor, completely flat and jumping back up. Five repetitions, then again, 30 seconds of quick feet. Keep this doing for 30 seconds. Then we have 10 deadlifts. So like in the strength part, a deadlift, you keep your back straight. The weight is in between your feet. And 10 times you go up and down. Again, 30 seconds of quick feet. Then we do one-armed thrusters. We take our two weights, we keep it on the shoulder. We stand in a squat position. And for a thruster, we go down and up. Down and up. We repeat this for 20 times in total, so 10 times each side. Fully down and completely up with the weight. 
when you've done this 20 times. Again, 30 seconds of quick feet. And the last exercise is 30 sit-ups on the floor with your feet against each other, hands behind the head, and you touch your toes 30 times. And this you repeat for three, four, or five rounds. Good luck, and see you next time for the next video. Bye-bye.